Colin Chabane Mayer, Moses Maluleke, will be laid to rest this morning. The 56-year-old was shot dead last month outside his home in what was suspected to be a robbery. His 18-year-old son was also wounded in that incident. Yesterday, two suspects arrested for his murder appeared in the Malamulele Magistrates Court. Another was released as police say he cannot be positively linked to the murder. Here's our report with Pilani Pakhari. The ANC Youth League in Vembe demands answers. They are opposing bail for the alleged killers of Mayor Moses Maluleke here at the Malamulele Magistrates Court. Shumani Namadozi and Abatakali Malaudzi are said to be responsible for the mayor's gruesome killing. The pair had no legal representation and will remain in custody until the 10th of August and the community is happy with the court's decision. We want to know why they killed the mayor, who sent them, how much we pay, we, we, they paid to deserve uh, to kill a mayor just like that. And another issue is that as a youth of Kolis Chawan, we are still shocked. If, if people can enter the place, the, our area and kill the mayor, I mean the first citizen, that means there's no one who's safe. The community safety MEC Polly Wushielo expressed her gratitude to the police for swift arrest. No, we are very happy and I want to thank our police services. Uh, for working so hard so that we are able to get the perpetrators. Uh, you can see that uh, it was full here, uh, somewhere in plain clothes. Also the equipment that we are using, uh, they, they are the ones that we are able to get these people because they are too advanced and uh, you can see we are here and we are going to be here until the end. And I'm happy with the briefing that they've given me. Uh, we've made a breakthrough and watched the space. We're going to arrest everybody who was involved in this matter. The ANC in Weber says if there are more culprits involved, they should also be arrested. They must all of them rot in jail. They took away from us the glue that held us together as an organization in the region. Uh, we are going through a very difficult time as the ANC in Wembe and uh, we will be here in court until the last day when these people are uh, sentenced uh, uh, in jail. NPA remains confident with his case against the pair, despite being forced to leave one suspect out because of lack of evidence. At this stage, we can't talk about the merits of our case. Initially, the police have arrested three suspects, but through the investigation, they couldn't link the third one. That's why we are remaining with the two who are linked to the incident. The NPA says it has not overruled the possibilities of effecting more arrests. In fact, it says it is confident in the case it has against the two suspects whose case has now been postponed to the 10th of August to allow for them to apply for legal aid and for further investigations. For Newsroom Africa on Channel 405, I'm Belana Pakhadi in Malamulele in Limpopo.